Hey guys, welcome back to Runs the Math Club. Today's topic is multiplying money. So in this topic, I'll show you how to multiply money whenever you have word problems like this I have up in the board. Okay, now I'm going to be using these three easy steps, and they're really um, simple to follow. Okay, so let's say we have the word problem. Brian bought five books for $6.99 each. What was his total cost? Okay, so what they're asking is that he bought, Brian bought five books, and each of them, so individually, they were six nine nine each. Okay, so what we need to do is we need to multiply six dollars ninety nine cents by the number five to get the total amount of money that um his, what was his total cost. Okay, so step number one is multiply and forget the decimal point. Okay, so right now I'm gonna forget the decimal point and simply multiply. So five times nine is forty five. Bring that 4 over, 5 times 9 is 45, plus that 4 is equal to 49, but I'm going to bring that 4 over again. And then 5 times 6 is 30, plus that 4 gives us 34, okay? And now, step number 2 is count the number of digits after each decimal point, okay? Uh, so there's, well, one decimal point, okay? So I have to count the number of digits after this decimal point, which are 1, and two. So we have two spaces after the decimal point. So we have two digits after the decimal point. Step number three is put the decimal point that uh, that many spaces from right to left into your um product. Okay, your product is three, four, nine, five. And, and, I, start, and I start off by going from right. Okay, so I put the decimal point to the right. And I take it from right to left. Okay, so I need to bring it over from right to left. But how, but how many spaces? Two spaces, so one space, two space, put the decimal point here. Now I have my new number, which is a decimal number, which is 34.95. So change from 3495 to 34.95. So this is how you multiply money. Um, check out our blog at bronzesmacclub.com, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye.